Hello, Internet, and welcome to a new and hopefully wonderful episode of Pike Slaying Grumites from a distance. Uh, okay. Oh. Uh, he's got a bow, too. Missed. <laughs> He's shooting. <laughs> He's shooting too low. That's funny. Ow, now he's not. You missed. somebody else. There's another guy somewhere. Whoa, he shot like several arrows against the stairs. Where are they? Hi, Buster. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, hello, hello. You know what? Ah, ouch. Hit me once. Okay, okay. Hi. Uh oh. Whoop. We're gonna play a little game of jump. <laughs> Not bad, but now comes the grand finale. Okay, he survived that. Not bad. These people can take a lot of arrows. I mean, look at that and imagine a human being. I think we would be dead after one or two. These guys, nah. Twelve. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay. Go. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, strong potion of healing. Good, 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 good. Excellent stuff. And what might this be? Hmm. Whatever it is, it's not very useful. Ah, oh, Grumites again. Up there. Oh, that's the third uh, Judgment Nexus, I dare say. Is that just one? No, that's three. Great. Great, three of them. Wonderful. Ah, uh, Have I ever told you how I don't like you? Up oh, this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. F follow me. Come on. I'll nail you to the door. Ah, there you are. Good boy. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Not good. Ouch. Ah! 
Ouch. I'm out of arrows. I can't be. I can't be out of arrows. Well, then we'll take those. Well, then come up here. What was that? What was that? Will you die already? This is kind of like... Whoa, finally. Ah, uh, you got one of those. Oh. Uh oh. Uh, no, no, no. Okay. Ow. Whoa. <laughs> this is kind of like strange. Hello. now. Ouch. Up. Oh. Missed me. Uh. Almost got him. Almost. Ouch! Wow! Wow! Oh, this is charge. One, no mistake. Oh, and I got number three. I've discovered the third and final focus crystal. I should place it in its judgment nexus to continue. All right, so I'll do that. Oop. Bala. Nothing. Weren't there three of them? Is number three standing behind the door? Yeah! I knew it! <laughs> Somehow he didn't come through. No idea why. You were waiting for what? The bus? Nice flying, though. Uh, won't take your bone, but I'll take your money. Okay. Yeah. 
Yes, I've placed a third and final focus crystal into its judgment nexus. The path to the resonator of judgment itself is now clear. My next task should be to attune the resonator by using the attenuator of judgment that Sheogorath provided me. Really? Maybe I should have read that book, huh? Where's where's the book? Where's the book? Manual of Xedillion. There it is. Hmm. Here it is. The heart of Xedillion is its power source, the resonator of judgment. By tuning this huge chunk of crystal with the attenuator of judgment, a tuning fork of sorts, we have released a wave of siren-like sound that will draw anyone from outside the aisles. Hey, that's gonna include me. I'm gonna be stuck here forever. Three focus crystals have been placed throughout the site to assist in keeping this wave of sound even and stable. This site will not function without all three focus crystals running in unison, so it's important to keep them clean and safe on their cradles, which I have called their judgment nexus. The focus crystals are irreplaceable at this time, so take proper precautions guarding the site when not in use. Xildillion is split into three encounter areas, all linked with the latest in arcane transport technology. As the hapless Xidillionites, it was fun to experiment on them, thank you for that, make their way through each room, they are subjected to a test based either on the manic philosophy or that of the demented, whichever suits your whim at the time. All you need to do is push a single button, then sit back with your favorite wine. We've provided luxurious observation platforms from which to enjoy the show and watch the results. Each encounter area has a unique theme that matches your requests as close as we could provide. I think you'll be pleased with the results. Below I have detailed each room and the effects you can expect from them. In brief, as I know your lordship is busy. Chamber of Conversion, a fairly empty room with a large grating on the floor and single half-sized harmless gnarl wandering in the center. Manic Result, our small harmless gnarl will be grown in size to nearly thrice that of the average Xedillionite. Most we observe run around in an attempt to escape the lumbering creature. Eventually, it will stop and fade away. The magic of the room is enhanced by the spore gas we pump in through the grating. Demented result, our tiny friend Gnarl is joined by a small swarm of its brethren and they attack our surprise guests. Genius. Chamber, oh, this is like a holodeck for adventures, right? Y you go in and you never get out because you get one adventure after the other, is that it? That's how you trap adventures around here? The poor adventurer. He'll be trapped forever, huh? Because they have teleport devices, which means he goes from room to room to room, and then again the next room, and the room he w has been before, and again, I see. Okay. I hope you're pleased with the results of Xedillion. I know you'll have just as much fun using it as we had fun constructing it. Strangely, we have yet to receive payment for the site, but I'm sure it is just a minor oversight, and it will be corrected as soon as your lordship has a moment. <laughs> I see, I see, I see. So he doesn't keep bargains, huh? Is that it? The nasty bugger. Hmm. <laughs> Let's check out my map. Map. The attenuator. Yep, I guess this is the way to go. Oh, Grandma, it's behind the door. I can hear him. Of course. Hi. Oh, he took next to no damage. Oh, and he's got a bow. I'll keep in movement. Oh. Um, 
two of them, which makes this kind of hard. You missed. Ah, uh, but you didn't. Okay. hit me. <laughs> That's kind of a strange game we're playing here. Dodging. Oh. Will you die already? Whew. And this guy didn't notice anything. Of course not. Why should he? I mean... Amazing how ignorant people can be. Like, there's some battle noise behind me, but no, no, no. Doesn't concern me. The sergeant said I should be responsible from here. Nothing else. No arrows on the steps, although I saw a few. Hmm. Nope. Where'd he go now? Ah, uh, he saw me. Ah, uh, and he's got arrows too. Missed me. Ow. Oh. Bad dodge, bad dodge. I want arrows. Durable dwarven war something. I guess he means axe. A flawed pearl. Arrgh. Oh, by the way. Sorry. I think the blue light actually looks better, you know that? Grumites, whatever they're praying for. Oh, that must be the attenuator. But of course, the gate is opened elsewhere. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's compose ourselves and we will attack those praying Grumites in the next episode. Pike is signing off. <laughs> it's, it's like taking a deep breath before the final run. 
Yeah, it's gonna be my Gettysburg. <laughs> See you then.